Good morning, everyone. What is it, day eight today? Yeah, eighth day. And I don't have uni today because basically we've all got this thing due in tomorrow, so we're not in today, so we can like finish doing that. I need to get that finished. Um, it's like a four tasks that I need to do, but obviously I've started. But before I do that, I'm just gonna give my room a quick tidy up, put some washing on and put away some washing that I've already done. So yes, it is like 12 o'clock now, but I just haven't been vlogging <laughs> yet. But now I am, so I just feel like there's always no point vlogging when I'm not really doing anything or when I have nothing to say, because just boring really. I have had some toast, exciting. And yeah, I'm gonna get on with some stuff. So um, I have tidied my room now and I've just started to do the rest of my work which is due in tomorrow. And I haven't got too much to do but I need to finish writing it and then do the like design aspect of it like make it look nice because it's like a portfolio thing and we have to make it look nice so I need to design like however I want it to look. But now I'm just going to quickly show you, I showed you some of the work, this was for, uh, for a different unit, I showed you some of the work that um, me and my partner did but she sent me the rest of it now that we did on her laptop so I'm going to show you that. So we, I showed you this one already, it's like promoting British apples and then we've got this one that's like presented on a bus that's got like the tube map made of apples and this one's just in a like airport and it's basically like you know how cups of tea are like British so we've done the apple shaped teapot and then this was just another idea which is the, meant to be the Big Ben with like an apple face and then a different brief we had was for a festival and we've created it's called Soho Create and we've created this poster to advertise it so it's in like neon kind of thing and then here's another one we've done so that's all for that one and obviously we've got other ideas but we need to um, make them up on here so I'm quite proud of, proud of that because I think they look quite cool and they fit in with what we're meant to be doing quite well so I'm gonna get started now on the work that's actually due in tomorrow because this isn't due until the 23rd I think so I've got like a couple weeks I think on this one but we have actually nearly finished so that's quite good. Beautiful once again. So I just made some more croissants like I made the other day with avocado and tomato and pesto but we don't have any greens like spinach or rocket so didn't manage to put any of them in but that's okay. Woo. And now I'm gonna eat it. So I forgot to tell you but um, for the past like hour-ish I've just been doing this poster for Jack and his group at uni. They're doing a Christmas quiz called Quizmas. And so yeah I've been doing that so I can just show you it so far. Here's the poster I have created. I'm just trying to figure out what to do here because it looks a bit stupid, but um, I might just put like a snowflake here, but I don't know, I might just get rid of them things completely because they look a bit silly. But yeah, I'm really proud of the rest of it. I think it looks quite cool. Whoa. And I think Sarah and Lucy are popping over because Lucy needs to borrow a Christmas jumper for tonight for one of her cheer socials. And Sarah wants to borrow a floaty top or something for um, her skiing trip. Not sure what it's really for, but I will. And she's also bringing over my stuff that I left there on Tuesday. I was gonna go get it tomorrow morning, but that's nice. She's bringing it now because I did that poster. I got a bit off track with the thing that's due in tomorrow. So I still need to finish that, but it's okay. It won't take too long and it's only five o'clock, so. I have got tonight and like the whole of tomorrow. It's not due in tomorrow till 10 p.m. So it should be fine. I don't have loads to do anyway, so yeah. Hello everyone. So <laughs> me, and <Jack laughs> me and Jack just ordered um, from delivery because we still had some free credit on there. And Jack's got a busy night tonight, so it's a good night to order. And we ordered from Tiger Lily, which is a Chinese and Indian place that we've ordered from before. The best one in the world. Yeah, it's really good. It's like the best one ever. 
and I ordered, well, we're sharing this seaweed because we had like a couple pounds left, so. And then I got, I have vegetarian duck, which I've never tried, but it looks pretty legit. And it comes with pancakes and like the cucumber and the sauce and stuff, so that's exciting because I haven't had that since I've been vegetarian. And then we got some vegetable noodles to try, which are like the best vegetable noodles ever. Here they are. <laughs> and Jack got some salt and pepper real duck. Hey guys, so I've just been watching some vlogs. I was having a break from, it's quite late now, it's like nearly midnight, but, um, so I'm probably gonna go to sleep soon, but I've nearly finished my uni thing, which is a bit luck, because it is during tomorrow, not till 10 p.m., but I still need to do one of the tasks, but all I have to do for that task is basically it's a like copywriting portfolio, the thing, and task three, we have to write an epitaph, epitaph, epi epitaph, epi, <laughs> I feel like I'm saying that totally wrong. Epitaph, epitaph, I don't know. You know the things that are like written on gravestones? Um, we have to write two of them, but there's only 20 words per one. So I might just do that quickly now because it won't take long. And we have to pick two out of this list and there's like Peter Pan and Father Christmas and your favorite teacher, your dentist, stuff like that on it, so kind of fun well it's right it's not really fun <laughs> it's writing for a dead person but they're not actually dead so it's okay and I've just been watching Naomi Smart's vlogs and I always watch them anyway but she's doing vlogmas at the moment and I'm really enjoying them and she she did an aerial yoga class and it looks so fun but I'll show you she's like swinging on these things and it just looks like so cool like some of them did actually look like exercises, like not that one, but like they're just all like stretches and stuff. But they look really fun and it's kind of making me want to do like a class of some kind. Like it would be really cool if I had a class booked in like once a week for something. Like not even just that, but it did just look up and they have got one in Southampton, so that's quite cool. But I haven't really got the money to do that at the moment, but something I would quite like to do like after Christmas is join a class or something. Um, I'd quite like to do exercise classes too, just because like if you're booked in for it, you kind of have to go and it's like, I feel like it could be quite enjoyable. But it's just be nice to have it as part of my routine. Also trying to drink this, all this water before bed. I've already had like two of these today, but I just want another one because my skin's... It's all right, but for some, I think I need a new foundation because my skin looks worse when I have foundation on, like the actual like dryness of it. So I've been trying to moisturize and I've had a couple days without makeup, so that's quite nice actually. I kind of wish I could just do that more often. Hey guys, so I just wanted to say good night because I have already fallen asleep, but I woke up again and I really sent say good night and then I got hungry, so I went and got some toast. Um, it's currently 20 to three, but I have slept a bit. I just woke up. So I thought I might as well say goodnight. Goodnight. Hope you had a lovely day. Bye.